Another rainy day did not stop Mardi Gras parades from rolling in downtown Mobile. Many people showed up for today's trio of parades, including the historic Joe Kane Parade. And now News 5's Cameron Edgeworth caught up with parade goers who did not let the rain stop them. Cameron? Ashley, that's right. Today was definitely a much different day from yesterday. Mobile police say that nearly 17,000 people showed up to have a good time for Mardi Gras. And I caught up with those people to talk to them about why they braved the rain. And I also talked to a couple from Houston who weighed in on that um, New Orleans versus Mobile Mardi Gras celebrations debate. Sunday showers did not stop Mobilians from celebrating. People had their tents and umbrella hats ready. It's really important for us to come to these parades because Mardi Gras is a really big part of what it means to be a Mobilian. And so it's just that since one of them got canceled, we just need to be out here even though it's raining just to see as many as we can. And it wasn't just Mobilians at the parade. Sean and Cheryl Harris are visiting from Houston, Texas. Well, we actually drove through New Orleans to come to Mobile first. And we did go down uh, Bourbon Street Canal. It was definitely a lot of fun, but not family oriented. It all Not like all. Mobile is. Uh, this is the original place and it is family oriented and we'll be back next year. And when asked how New Orleans celebrations compared to Mobile's. I would say Mobile definitely has New Orleans hands down. And many Mobilians we asked felt the same way. For all the historians out there, Mardi Gras started here in Mobile, the port city. Now, right now, all parades Monday are scheduled to take place, including the Mystics of Time Parade, which was postponed until Monday at 8.30. Of course, stay with WKRG News 5 because we will keep you posted on any changes. But for now, reporting live here in downtown, I'm Cameron Edgeworth for News 5.